what you want. You I'm telling you the truth. I'm not you being polite. I'm like. telling you the truth. Yes. I'm telling you the truth. Do what you want. I said do what you want. Do what you want. You want to pay me? I said do what you want. Yes. I said I can't. I said I can't. Don't tell me what to do. I said I can't. You are being toxic and I've never seen a woman like you. Do what you want to do. I said like that. She's very selfish, this woman. I've never seen this kind of woman in my life. Do what you want to do. It's true. This woman, she's selfish. Do what you want to do. If you want to take me back to the office, I will not stay in this house with this toxic woman like here. Do what you want to do. Everything, everything, she's complaining here. They said, do what you want to do. And I'm not afraid of you. If you want to take me back to Kenya right now, I will not stay in your house. Do what you want to do. She's being toxic, this woman. She's being toxic. Madam Gada is toxic. Very toxic. She's toxic, this woman. And why? What's happened? I respect everybody who is elder, but she's toxic. You are toxic, yes. madam. You are toxic, I said. You are toxic. Don't tell me what to do. Very toxic. You like to provoke someone. If you want, you can take me back to Kenya right now. I don't care. Yeah, what's wrong? Ask her. She what? pretends innocent. Ask her. What? And I've never seen a woman who is toxic like Madame Gaga. She's toxic. Very toxic. Very toxic. I said like Shut that. Up. Very up. toxic. Yes. Shut do up. what you want to do. Shut up. You want to kill me? Kill me. Kill me. Kill me if you want. She's toxic. I don't want to see you. I'm tired of you. There's no, I don't, I didn't know what's the problem. Ask her, she's, what's the ask problem? Her, tell her I'm tell asking you. you. She's what? the answer, she's supposed to tell you. Because she's acting innocent. Let what? her do what she wants to do. What, 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 what happened? I'm tired of this woman. I'm tired. Okay, what happened? Ask her, go and ask her. And I'm tired, I have a lot of stress. My family is stressed, my own personal stress. And she's stressing me. I okay, but what to... happened? What happened? Tell ask me what... Ask her. You should ask her and tell but her. I'm asking you. No, go and ask her. And I'm tired, mister. If you want, you can take me back to Kenya. Kill me here. I don't care. No, no, no. I will send you to Kenya. It's okay. Don't worry. She's toxic. This. I will send you to Kenya. Don't worry. I will order another girl. Uh... Hey, it's... Hey, guy. It's a sign here. So guys, kuna mambo unaweza kufanya kakakupea raha tena hiyo mambo moja ikakupea shida. Guys, hii nchi na kuanga nchi ya wenyewe. Na sometimes unaweza kufanya kitu ukuje regret baadaye. Hawa watu wanakuanga sumbua. Hakuna vile utaambia mwarabu do what you want. Na still bado uko hapo. Wa Kenya viburi mnatoanga wapi? wa Kenya viburi uwanga mnatoa wapi after mmefanyiwa hicho kitendo ama mambo inafanyikana ya huku ya huku kiburi mnatoanga wapi sometimes learn how to silent kuwa mkimya mkimya nyamaza unajua no kinyamaza inasaidia kushinda kubweka bweka kama mboya unabweka bweka sio unabweka bweka nini nyamaza sometimes sometimes kunyamaza inasaidianga lakini nyinyi mko na vierere. Hmm. Mko na vierere. Na kuambia sasa hii Arabu amekuwa wabaya. Alafu uko tu na audacity ama uko tu na nguvu ya kugombanishia Arabu wako vile unataka na kurecord kamera na kuchungudia kidogo hivi. Pale jua jua kwamba una risk maisha yako. First of all yule mwarabu hajataka kukujibu na once agikujibu 
mambo ingekuwa bad news na hajataka kujibu yeye amekunya mazi yetu sauti yake ijasikika na omba Mungu sana uko na posi nzuri hao watu wanga wanazumbua hapo inafikanga the moment ya kukuja mdozi ana, anajipendekeza kwako we ni mzuri we ni mzuri anafika mahali anakuwekea sumu kwa chakula unakula unakufa slow poison ni kitu mbaya sana sometimes ladies learn how to learn how to to nini to to be silent kuwa kimya hmm. kuwa tu kimya jifundishe kunyamaza sio tu kila kitu unaoneshana sasa sasa hii umeshafanya hicho kitendo sisi tumeona kwa kamera tumeona umefanya hicho kitendo mwarabu waka kikuwa tena tutaona tu akikutupa from juu mpaka chini utafanya nini nothing you can do atakuumiza wewe utakuja hapa ndani unaanza kulia naomba usaidizi mwarabu wangu amekunaka na yeye atabaki huko kwenye ndio Saudi Arabia unaona yeye atabaki huko hakuna yule mdozi anaweza kubali msichana wa kazi kukua juu yake lakini sometimes wa Kenya wakifika huko na kuanga vichwa ngumu yes we know arabu ni wabaya tena wabaya sana lakini learn how to be silent my sister ka kimya kimya kabisa na ukimya ka kimya hata usiongee kwa sababu the moment unaongea mambo inakuwa wazi inatakana unanyamaza unanyamaza tu hakuna vile utakaa pale na mwarabu na unapiga makelele lazima nyumba watu wawili wakiwa haitempa lazima mmoja atanyamaza ndio umepata umeongea hiyo mambo yote mwarabu wako amenyamaza atakuja kujibu na hujui kwa hiyo roho yake ni nini anafikiria ama ni nini anawaza ama ni nini anaweza kufanya ukisema take me to the office take me to your kenya take me to orema Uti, unafikiria ofisi ni kitu tu simple utabebwa tu hivi unapelekwa fikiria kwanza umemaliza muda gani hapo na ukianza mambo kama haya ni nini umefanya pale you understand angalia makosa yako nu angalia makosa ya watu compare between yeye na ndio maana unaonanga hata ukimwaraba kikukosea kubali wewe ndio uko na makosa kwa sababu hii engine ya wenyewe hakuna yule mtu anakubali ya kwamba aruda akiwa na cut guest hakuna tunatakanga vile tuliacha watoto wetu akiwa Kenya salama turudi tuone watoto wetu lakini you ladies mkifikanga huku kwanza hawa team jedid wanajionanga viburi sana unafika huku 3 month 4 month umeanza kuwa kiburi hapo ndo unapatanga most of you mnanyongwa mnafinywa mnatupwa kwa freezer na mnanyamasishwa mwarabu tu ana anapanguza tu mdomo hakujui na amekufinya amekuweka kule kwa freezer unatulia tu kule pale pale pole ukikuwa ice usiku na mchana mm. ulinyamazishwa wewe hata ujui uko wapi sometimes learn how to be silent my sister sio kila siku na kwa tu high temper wewe ndo unajua kujibu mwarabu wako wewe ndo unajua kumwambia hivi wewe unajua kumwambia hiki na hiki wewe ndo unajua everything learn how to be silent sometimes silent is the key silent is the key unanyamaza tu afanye kile kinamfurahisha tunasemanga do what makes you happy hmm. do what makes you happy do what you feel you are happy you understand wewe unamwangalia tu macho hivi si lazima upishane na mwarabu si lazima muongeleshe it's not a must sometimes let's be silent the moment unamuongelesha hivyo na kaa ukijua hiyo engine ya wenyewe anaweza uoneza kukuvamia na familia mzima wakakupiga my friend wakakupiga na wakakuua utafanya nini hauna mama huku hauna baba huku hauna ndugu hauna dada hauna chochote wewe tena Mungu wako by the time hiyo Mungu anakuja kujibu maombi yako ushakufa Mungu anajibu maombi yako kama ushakufa kitambo sana umefriziwa hmm. sometimes wacheni kuwa mat high temper kwa hawa watu yes we know warabu ni wabaya lakini sometimes learn how to mind yani learn how to, to reduce your temper temper yako irudi chini my sister sio wewe uko high quality mwaraba ko high quality simba wawili hakuna ile siku watai kani ni nyumba moja 
watakwarana lazima moja itulie nyingine ipande juu ndio there is no umepata huyo marabu wako ametulia wewe umepanda juu unajichocha kabisa hapo na mdomo yako kaya venye unasema do me do me what you want she can do you she or he or she can do you chenye chenye wanataka wakikufreeze utafanya nini utafanya nini na umeacha watoto kule nyumbani angalia familia yako angalia background yako kwanza mahali umetoka before kuanza kupayuka hiyo mdomo yako kama samaki yenye imetoka nje angalia kwanza background yako kwanza nikifanya hiki kitu kinaweza fresha mtu ama nikifanya kinaweza kuacha si waraboto wazuri my sister hmm? in fact si waraboto wazuri si waraboto wazuri upende usipende sio arabu wote wazuri Ona. sio arabu wote wazuri kabisa unaweza kuna mjibu yeye amenyamaza kuna mwingine gaidi nyingine utakutana nayo my friend itakupiga na ikunyonge na ikuue na kuna mali utaipeleka nate utakapopayuka mdomo yako kama mtu mwenye hata ajijielewi na unaudiwa bure utafanya nini Utafanya nini? Mhm. Ushapigu ushauli wanzenu. Asara ni kwa nani? Ni kwa Mwarabu ama asara ni kwa mama yako? Mhm. Asara ni kwa Mwarabu ama asara ni kwa mama yako na familia yako na watoto wako? Sometimes angalia background mahali umetoka. Angalia hiyo background mahali umetoka. Hiyo background iko aje. Ndio uanze kukuja kuanza kupayuka mdomo kwanza kujibishana na Waarabu. Waache sometimes leave them alone. Wacha waongee. Waarabu akiwa na high temper bora kuchapi. Muache. Wacha abweke bweke hapo wakimaliza basi wewe una mind wa own na ana mind ya own. Na tena Waarabu akiona umuongeleshi ataachana na wewe. Hata shindie tu anajua wewe umuongeleshi unamwangalia hivi unakuwa kama kio unamwangalia tu. Afanye tu mambo yako. The better you have earphones. Unua earphones. Pia kwa masikio judge seti muziki yako na piki wangu kelele ikisikia muziki hatu hiyo anaongea nini vitu kama hizo sometimes zinasaidia but you guys hamtakangi kusikia ukiambiwa hiki mnaona mnaambiwa kibaya hakuna vile wewe uko kwa 14 country ama uko kwa country yenyewe ni una raise hiyo mdomo wako mkubwa unaambia mwarabu do do what you want do what you want na uko kwa yenyewe ungesema do what you want ukiwa uko kwenye sahi kwenye kumaka moto Watu wanauliwa usiku na mchana. Na umekuja kujifichilia huku. Ukuja ushughulikie watoto wako wale wasome. Mama kule, mama ajengewe nyumba. Wewe umekuja huku kupayuka mdomo. Kazi yako ni kutukana Mwarabu na kumsha utia kama ni engagement yako. Na umesahau ya kwamba uhai wako yeye ndiye amekubebea. Amekubebea uhai hivi kwa mkono. Venye unapumua na kwa na kuonanga tu hapa hivi. Alafu uko hapo. Unalala na herufu moja, unakula na ye unafanya ni hapo unapumua ukiwa hapo haujipendi sometimes mimi naambia anga mnasemanga mimi naongea anga vibaya haujipendi hakuna vile ukaanza kujibu mwarabu wako vile unataka as in like ni brother yako ama ni mama yako ni mtu mjui all all too nyinyi ni strangers hamjulikani hapo ni unapatanga mwarabu anakufreeze asha kufinya asha kuanza kule kwa mochu ari amekuachanisha kule Familia yake inaanza kukuja but oh msichana alikuja akadisappear oh alitoka online kumbu lifriziwa kitabu umekuwa ice cube umekaa kule umefreeze na hata ujulikani umefreeze na kabisa wazazi wako wanakuja hapo kuanza kuuliza eh, hakuna kesi hakuna chochote kisa na maana we ulikuwa na mdomo nawaambianga ladies hiyo mdomo yako yenye uko na mdomo hiyo mdomo yako nawaambianga ladies every time i'm telling you my sister hiyo mdomo yako funganga vizuri ukifika pale airport kuna dem or chali anakuanga pala na kuenga anakuwekeanga exit ule na kupekeanga stambu ya exit exit ni in eh wao na kuwekeanga exit out huyo mwana anakuwekeanga exit ya nje huyo mchukua maizi matempa zako muachie mwambie brother sister nieke ile siku nitakuja ndazichukua kama unaona unaweza kupana na hizo high temp zako huko kingdom of Saudi Arabia fanya nini ukifika pale airport hmm? ukifika pale airport ha, wewe fanya nini 
ambia wale wanakuanga wale wanurukia exit in eh, exit me in kuambia wa kuweke hizo high temper zako wakati utamaliza contract unaenda unazichukua unarudi nazo kwenu unaleta kisirani kwa nyumba ya mwarabu na ni yetu wapo kwa contract ulue si boy kembo anaweza kuleta mdomo na hivyo hivyo taxi imesimama nje wako kwa contract utafanya nini kana ujichunguze